the sebaceous cyst is a retention cyst arising due to the blockage of sebaceous duct and accumulation of secretions within the gland these sebaceous glands are located in the dermis and their duct opens directly into the skin or into the hair follicles these gland secretes sebum these are also called as epidermoid cyst though it is a swelling arising from the dermis layer it has clinical features of an epidermal swelling this is a cl- classical clinical finding in a sebaceous cyst that is a black punctum which represent a blocked duct the skin not pingeable is a classical finding which tells that this swelling is an epidermal swelling another important classical finding in a sebaceous cyst is yielding on pressure so this clinical examination differentiated from a lipoma which slips away from the palpating finger and also transillumination in this cyst will be negative so the classical findings in sebaceous cyst are presence of a punctum skin not pingeable edges yield on pressure transillumination negative this is a sebaceous cyst of the scalp this has to be differentiated from dermoid cyst the classical differentiating feature is the presence of alopecia in sebaceous cyst and there will be bony indentation in case of dermoid cyst so what is the treatment treatment is excision under local anesthesia you put an elliptical incision around the punctum and remove the cyst in toto along with the capsule this is the organism which is present in on the wall of the sebaceous cyst that is demodex follicularum now what are the complications the most common complication is infection here you can see redness around the cyst the treatment is antibiotics when there is pus point you can do incision and drainage and removal of the sac next complication is a sebaceous horn when the sebaceous material escapes through the punctum and accumulates on the surface of the sebaceous cyst and gets dried in successive layers forming a horny projection called the sebaceous horn this is a cox peculiar tumor following infection and ulceration of the cyst there is escape of cyst content on the surface this chronic irritation may lead to formation of granuloma on the surface of the sebaceous cyst and this may mimic a fungating epithelioma and this appearance is described as cox peculiar tumor another rare possibility of sebaceous cyst is the sebaceous cyst turning malignant so these are the complications infection ulceration sebaceous horn cox peculiar tumor and malignancy this is multiple sebaceous cyst of the scrotum which is also called as mulberry scrotum or wen it is a solid swelling without punctum it may be multiple when it is multiple you can excise the sebaceous cyst along with the scrotal skin when it is single you can excise it alone when the sebaceous cyst involve the entire scrotal skin you can do a scrotectomy 